Becca and welcome to a summer afternoon here at a little farmhouse on the northern plains of Iowa. I just finished doing some lesson planning for our upcoming homeschool year, which I'm really looking forward to. But now I just wanted to make a cup of chamomile tea that we have growing in our garden and tidy up my kitchen before I make dinner later on. So as always, I'm so glad you're here with me today and have stopped by for a visit here at our home, the carriage house. Was a night meant to lie in your arms here for a while. I'm alive and I take you in. I've been far. When I reach out, you will hold on Was it a rainbow falling? Was it a rainbow falling? When I touch you, it will break through Was it a rainbow falling? Was it a rainbow falling? Oh, was it a of a disarray. Little puddles on the floor by the front door from the kids playing in the sprinkler. Bits of broken crayons spewed about from little ones creating while I try to catch up on cleaning, lesson planning, and make dinner while my husband was away in Portugal for a week. But I know this home will never know perfection. And you know, I don't want it to. I'd rather live in a small lived-in home with warm memories and beauty that could be found in imperfections because we never know how much time we truly have in this world. Life is a gift, and we should enjoy and make the best of the present. Hey, at least I'm breathing. I know it took a while. Been looking for a sweet song, a sign of spring. Waiting for a reason to laugh, to sing. Cause I've been spending all my time to figure out just how. I'm 
understanding I know it could be worse I know it could be broken We could be crushed And every word I've spoken Could have been my last to you Instead of spending all my time to figure why to me